If I, I apologize if I just accidentally shut you in our house. <laughs> that second time was deliberate, though. Oh, right. Yeah, well. First time was accidental. So, are we still doing stuff in the land where food doesn't work? Yes. Yes. Alright. Uh, I'm not sure how much so stuff we need to do. Like, the immediate thing is getting the thing for the smeltery. Okay, I was imagining maybe we could split up and look for clues because when we all went to the between, it was not very productive last week. In the yeah. RCX and final site, we're kind of RCXing while the rest of us were kind of standing around with no idea what we were trying to do. Well, I have then, absolutely no idea which direction to go. Then I would ask if we, if I split up and look for clues, do we mean split up and look for clues in the between, or some of us go to the between and some of us go elsewhere, or what? Well, I mean, some of us do something else. I think there's, I'm, uh, I'm not sure what else, I think there's some other stuff that we can do, sort of, uh... uh can all of the people who are in, uh, sleep? Alright, if someone's in the base, um, could someone go and look in the chest and find my atlas? Um, in which chest, pray? Here in, oh, the, he... in the crafting area. If he yeah. knew which chest, he wouldn't have to look for it. Oh, burning zombie. <laughs> I am carrying an atlas number, a spare atlas number zero, which I have just got from the chest in order to give to... Who am I giving it to? Finalist. No, final. My, my idea is you come to the between lands. I'm going to kill myself. I'll spawn back at the tree where I can pick up my atlas and find my body. Hold on. You're in the between lands now, right? Yes, lost in the between lands. Oh, I see. What anus is this with a skeleton shooting me in the backside with a bow and arrow? I'm not sure I approve. Wait, what anus? Sorry, I will come. Oh yeah, it's a, a swimming skeleton. Aha, it's alright, I uh, lured it out into the sunlight where it immediately caught fire. Excellent work, thank that you. That was right a short and eventful battle. Ooh, there's dragonflies in the, in the between lands. Cool. They draw it pretty cool, actually. So I'm near the tree here. Yeah, there should be a chest in the tree. Ah, uh, it must be in the trunk. I, 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 I don't know whether to give you a point or a deductive point for that. Right, there, your atlas is in the trunk, but can you see any landmarks? And I'll tell you... Um, like... I'm far away. I'm about to die anyway. I'm being attacked by ghosts. Where do you respawn? Do you respawn in the between lands or at, at your home or...? Um, here. <laughs> oh, I see you there. Hello. Your atlas is in the chest. What were we doing in the swamp anyway? I've forgotten. Looking for a gem. Oh, I'm assuming gems that aren't these giant glowing things on trees. No, they're under no, mushrooms. It's a blue gem or underwater which I need my pickaxe to do, which is on my body. Oh, I shouldn't have just died then, should you? I found a green middle gem. Uh, am I the only person in the main base? Possibly. Possibly. Where are you, Sasha? I'm near the portal in between lands. Why am I still carrying two boats? I don't know. Good answer. question. Uh, uh, uh -huh. I gather you are unsuccessful. So, final final. sight. Uh, no, I, I found it. It's... Ghost you also found away. the ghost that killed you the first time. Ah, yes. Yeah. Brilliant. Okay. We attacked by crabs. <laughs> I got one of the boys. Can you find things in the between lands that are edible? Yeah. What things uh, would you recommend eating in the between lands? Oh, crab claws. Yeah, I'm frogs and things like that. I'm gonna eat a crab claw. Basically, Mickey gumbo. <laughs> I have got on my list of dishes I want to try making a jambalaya at some well, point. Well, I have found a gem, but I just need to get my buddy to get it. Oh, you are <laughs> Ben Cisco, and I claim my five pounds. <laughs> we have been watching Deep Space Nine, indeed. So have we. Is, the, um... is, is Final going to cook that, that rock he's found and make a jambalaya? Hey! Oh. <laughs> Don't encourage him. No, right, I'm encouraging myself. No, I have been. My inspiration for I want to try making a jambalaya is indeed Cisco's dad. What Cisco's dad? Cisco. The, Cisco. the dad of the Cisco whom we're all thinking of. He is Cisco. Well, I'm thinking of Ben Cisco always. 
Exactly. And his father, Joseph Sisko, is therefore Sisko's dad rather than Sisko himself, despite also being Sisko. Or are you saying that if I say Sisko's dad, the Sisko you think of becomes Jake, so that you automatically think of Ben Sisko? Yes, yes, I'm saying, I am thinking, saying that. I see. Does between food still work if you take it back to real life? Yes. I think so, yes. Does stuff that you cook in real life that work from between food work if you bring it back to the between? So I have a raw frog stuff on me. I assume I need to cook that. If I go back to real life, cook it, and bring the cooked frog looks back, is it okay? Yeah. Probably. Let's find out. I'm going to go back to real life and cook a frog's egg. Back to reality. A guaranteed emergency. The radical MC HP's got the melody. Indeed. See, that's what I think of when I hear back to reality. I don't think of whatever it is that Dan said. Yeah. I think of Scooter. Oh, there is a lurker there. I would rather not fight you, please, Mr. Lurker, sir. I did consider fighting a lurk to see whether it gave me tasty food stuffs. But I assume it's quite dangerous. We have a mic tonight. Um, yeah, how, how do you think we can hear you? He says, helpfully. Meow. Oh, I think it is time for those of us at home to, uh, to sleep again. Ah, oh, here's an ender. Well, I really wish I had some arrows right now. While I'm in the elevated attacking position. Oh, God damn it. I didn't even notice the chest. I've been making... Weed with sticks, not noticing we've got loads oh. in the... Hey, uh, oh. did you, would you like some help down there? Um, if you can lend help, I would not be averse to it. He has a, quite a powerful sword on him. Well, Ooh, there's other zombie also. Oh, oh hello. There's one down. Oh, you can pick that guy's sword up. Unless I, I got it first. Uh -huh. I got one of them. I think you got the other guys. Um, I assume you have some sulfur. Hi. Uh -huh. Hello. Uh, Hello. Uh, hmm. uh, yes, in answer Is to your earlier question. Oh. Oh, uh, we need swamp water as well. Ow. Sounds like some sort of guy. A frog came through from the between lands. Hello, dude. Can I pick you up? Uh, there is an ender behind you. Don't make eye contact. Oh. They can't see us if we don't move. No, they oh. just don't, don't like. They're, they're like um, scousers. If you look at them, it's an invitation for a fight. Uh, Shall we sleep? So that they stop spawning all of these zombies and spiders and endermen. I was indeed on my way to sleep. Uh, I, I may not rest now, there are monsters nearby. I've got a frog! Ooh, middle gem. Lovely look! Hello. Oh yeah. It's, it's a frog. Uh, it's a bit... A, it's a disco frog, yeah. yeah. It really is, I don't know why. It came through from the between lands, so now we don't, know things can. Don't lick it. But I'm not going to. It's my new best wow, friend. I see your yeah. best frog. Oh, don't you lick frog. all your best friends? No. No, I put it down. Ed, can you open the door for me? Thank you. Can you gonna... close the door for me? I take it you're going to take the opportunity to build some sort of pen for the frog in there. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I, mean, I, I just put the subtitles on and I'm now getting things saying pig oink. Cow moves. <laughs> yeah, I, I've had the subtitles on all the time because I didn't trust my sound. So um, yeah. my sound sounds like a nursery rhyme. Gone for no reason. The what? What does the Enderman say? In this case, the Enderman says for whoop. Hey frog. Oh, hey Enderman. For whoop. Why is the Enderman? We probably want to kill it. <laughs> He's close to here. I draw my sword. I have just seen his pink things. Well. <laughs> Woof. I'm going to get an elevated location. My location is now elevated. So, uh, do you know what to do if you see an Enderman? Um, Bark in it, man. No, wait, that's the wrong joke. I do, it's okay. 
Uh, I'm watching Suz through a bedroom window. Why is there a death compass in your bedroom? I think she put that up as ornamentation. Oh no, there are three actually. Yes. Oh, I can only see one. Can you see... I can't see where you are. Can you see this cage though? That I'm no. walking in front of? Oh. No, I, I can't see the cage. Wait, you, your bedroom is also a dungeon. Well, for frogs, yeah. Oh, I see. It's weird otherwise. Uh, can I come and look? Yeah. I haven't called him anything yet, but... You can name Pierre. him like. Call him Pierre. Pierre, okay. Oh yes, that's quite cagey. Yeah. I don't want him to run away. Hello, Pierre. Wow. If I'd been smart, I should have left one of those gems with RCX. Uh, oh. why? Because I like the I shelf of flowers. Oh. oh. Bravo. Oh, this is a bit of a hole you can fall down. Yeah, but it's Ed's bedroom there, so it doesn't matter. <laughs> Oh yeah, why don't you put buttons in to make the doors go like everybody else has? Eh. <laughs> what about you, Final? Or was that a skeleton? Well, I'm crashed. No, not Final, sorry, uh, Tufty. But sorry. Uh, I'm not a skeleton. But are you blowing a trumpet? No, I'm not. This skeleton oh. over here is blowing a trumpet. He is no longer blowing his trumpet. Oh, now I have a spur trumpet. Thanks for <laughs> alerting me to that. You're welcome. It's a very low endurance, though. So are we when it comes to the trumpet. My horn is too strong. Uh, oh, somebody seems to have planted a row of trees like adjacent to each other, so it's just formed a wooden wall. For once, it wasn't me. Whoa! I still haven't seen hide nor hair with that Enderman, though. Oh. I thought we had, uh, yeah, I thought we had totems in the base so the creepers didn't. They're not, yeah, they're they're, they don't explode, the but they can still spawn. Ah, uh, okay. Ah yes, the duck's still there. Ed? Yeah. Why are you jumping on my flowers? What are you doing? <gasps> Ed, there's a gate here, you idiot. God damn. Oh. You think I'd build a garden without gates? Oh. How did you do that, though? What were you doing? How and what? Um, I accidentally came down from the roof. Yes. Ed, Ed, come and look up here. Yes, I've seen him. But have you seen him in the cage? Yes, I have. I came <laughs> down from the roof. Oh, excellent. Okay. You enjoying it up here on the roof, Cap? Yep. Uh, I j don't go on ground level anymore. On I only live up here. It's like one of those science fictions with you know the elite who live up in the clouds while the plebs live on the ground. What's don't want to be a pleb. What's it called? Uh, the TOS. Cloudminders. No, 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 no. The actual. Uh... Oh, Stratos. Stratos, yes. Stratos episode of Cloudminders. Um, with some excellent examples of William Wear Thayer's costume design. Oh, yes. That's just all of TOS. Oh, yeah, but there were particularly good examples the in that yes, episode. I, uh, oh, yeah, that, that episode, and also um, Who Mourns for Adonis. Mm, and I, I think the classic one is the. I can't remember which episode it was, but the, the costumes for the ladies just had, like, two silver straps in, like, an X shape. Oh, no, that, that, that's the next generation, right? The one where Wesley gets... Try, is, is put, is, no, oh, yeah, no, 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 it was even, even less material than that. There's the one where Scotty is on trial for murder. Because he's possessed what? by Jack the Ripper. I always found that Wesley episode funny, you know, just Wesley's there in his nerdy jumper. Yeah. Surrounded by all these constantly glad. <laughs> he's like, I think I went to the wrong summer camp. <laughs> he's like, that's the episode where he says the most, one of the most cringy Wesley lines of, I'm too young for that kind of game. Yes. And I'm with Starfleet, we don't lie. Like a petulant bastard. He is. Well, <laughs> to be honest, he's always right. <laughs> Except, well, well, that does like tend that to make time things that worse. He almost yes, destroyed the Enterprise by releasing nanites to it. Like, yeah, I think they made him always right and then realized that him being always right was obnoxious, so they made him not always right. Well, no, <laughs> there's a thing, he was right. Like, he said, oh, yeah, I think, I think the problems we've been having are these nanites. He wasn't wrong. Yeah, and say so for, for the first two or three seasons, you know, all of the problems would have been solved if they listened to Wesley at the start. Yeah. Yeah. Which, it's say, like Lex. Well. <laughs> oh, hey, RCX. Have you have you brought gems? 
Uh, yes, but final uh, has the one that's actually important. Oh, yeah. This doing stuff in parallel has not really worked out. Well, <laughs> uh, unfortunately, yeah, think... we do seem to be, in terms of, like, further advancements, um... I'm going to argue we are somewhat this. bottlenecked we... on getting iron. <laughs> yeah, yeah, but I oh, was, like, asking for people to go to the Betweenlands, like, three sessions ago. So that well, we could do that in parallel with me building the rest of the smeltery, and nobody did it. Well, last session I was waiting around for everyone to get Mike's body to go. Yeah. Yes, we had like a long period of trying to find bodies. <laughs> I think. Yes. <laughs> oh, did you say bodies plural there? Well, well I mean, it was, it was bodies plural. Bodies plural. <laughs> yeah, bodies plural. Yeah. We went to get my body, and then everyone else died in the process. <laughs> I didn't die in the process. So, remind me. I didn't die in the process. Remind me, how do we actually get iron? We go to the between lands for some reason. A gem, which we will use to make the smeltery controller, which is the last remaining part we need to build of the smeltery in this room. I've spawned so far away from the base. And then we put iron ore, which I think we already have in the smeltery and then iron comes out sorry we put iron clusters in the smeltery and then iron pops out okay so we've so we've actually got what we need to make the smeltery now that we found this mysterious gem yes yeah, but if, final if we can it, get the gem so... back <laughs> yeah, but, so for some reason i've spawned all the way um south of the base hey rcx <laughs> hey, RCX. Hey. Oh, Dufty. Stop blowing me from the roof. Ah, you put the thing in the middle. Ding! Smeltery controller. Does it matter which way round I put it? Um, not particularly. Baby stealing my buckets. Iron. Yeah, we just had the episode where Odo complained about that to Dax. So is this the the cast for a bucket? And and what do we do with the iron buckets? Well, the first thing we need to do is get some more lava, I think, so that we can refill. Yes. This. Oh. Well, it doesn't need refilling yet, but that in so that we have a means for refilling this tank of lava. And I remember that the buckets that we previously had, they, they were destroyed after one use, but I presume the iron bucket is not destroyed when you fill it with lava? Indeed. Yep. Indeed. Even though the lava is apparently hot enough to melt the iron. <laughs> Indeed. <laughs> yeah, it's a whole contention in Minecraft about it. <laughs> okay, we don't all need a bucket though. Like, it, this is not a one each item, really. Oops, shit. Shit. Well, I... Ow. Oh, try not to set fire to everything. RCX, what have you done? Have you overflowed the glass? Has RCX just burned the... He's uh, burning yeah. the whole place down with glass. Um, uh, Shit. Well, pick up the glass block that's at the top there. I can't. It's surrounded by flowing... There you go, glass. I've got it. <laughs> I wish I was in the game. Sorry, <laughs> this is like the... <laughs> don't come in, don't come in. This is like the floor is lava, isn't it? <laughs> No, Dan, the lava's, the lava's just fine. I can see the lava. Um, how it, do it I get the... It will dissipate. Perhaps that will it? <laughs> okay, uh, it's going right. down. Oh, dear lord. Yep. Okay, please don't do that again. Uh, <laughs> I will try not to. <laughs> can we have, like, an item stand and have a bucket here permanently, like, as a fire bucket? Um, so, in terms of transporting lava, it is convenient to also make uh, seared tanks. Oh, uh, yes. Do we not have one of those? Uh, yes, it's in the smelter, but you can make ah. another. Ah, yes, because previously we took the seared tank with us. Yes. Uh, I will see about making another one of those then. Probably need something I don't have that Final Sight's got a secret stash of. Uh, yes, you need glass and eight seared bricks. Or a clay barrel please? and eight seared bricks. And Tofty, could I have that rod, please? Uh, well, why did you give it to me? Um, you were standing on the anvil when I made it. <laughs> well, don't use an anvil while I'm standing on it. 
There's something awfully goon show about this bucket cast. The fact that you can, the fact that the bucket cast is a two-dimensional picture of a bucket. Here, step to this picture of a hole in the side of the airplane. Uh, did you jump on the farmland? You did. I just saw you. I actually did. Oh. Oh yeah. So I, the other thing you might find amusing about the casts is that you can build a stone bucket, which does not function as a bucket, but you can use it to make a cast to make a real bucket. I mean, I, 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 no, I can see that. I can see that. I mean, it makes sense for making like a wax bell that you then use to make a cast to make a real bell, but I don't know. It makes a bit less sense for buckets, I think. Yes. Maybe you're practicing for the bells. I request that we keep the night. Uh -huh. Oh yes, uh, I want to do some astral, magic. Astral sorcerying. Yes, I want to find some blue glow. Okay, so how do I make this? How do I make these slime boots? Like I need slime. So how do I get the slime? It doesn't slime look like balls. I make it from glue. Yeah. Do how do I get? The, how do I get? Use the glue those. to make a slime block, and then use that to make it into slime balls. I've seen oh, Mike's. I got it. I've seen Mike's balls. They're slimy enough already. Um, I don't know if there's a better way of making glue. Um, yeah, there's also hide, I suppose, could be turned into it, but that's so awkward. Well, uh, there, there, there is a there is a way, but um, you probably wouldn't like it. Uh -huh. what? Does it involve dying in order to like get the rotten flesh from your corpse? No, um, you put a horse in the smelter. Uh. <laughs> well, yeah, let's not do that. I mean, that makes sense, I guess. Um, okay. Uh, Eduardo, would you like some piles? Mm. <laughs> 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 You're saying that the theme's not working then? Um, would you, why, don't, why don't you come and do it yourself though? It's here. Okay. I hope you enjoyed this video today. I'll let RCX play you out with an expedition to scoop lava from the hunting dimension. Next time, Final Sight's stargazing hobby will put the whole village in peril while Tufty and Mike try out some slimy picks. So join us again for that. Toodle pip!